Hi guys, welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. Um, Isabel just told me that I'm going to have a meteor shower tonight. So I think we're going to time travel a little bit on this episode, since I don't usually get to play at night. I'm usually spending time with the husband in the evenings. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to see how Jacques' house looked. I'm not hating the red. I'm just not in love with it with these orange flowers. So I may, at a future date, change the colors up a bit, but we're going to keep it for now. I just wanted to see what the interior looked like. I'm like, honestly, like, I don't even remember what all I did in here. So let's take a peek, see how it's looking. Oh, yeah. Kind of a cute little vibe. I forgot how red it is. I like the red, though. Always a pleasure, Zutalor. Let's chat, bud. You always make a wish when you see a falling star, right? Because I sure do, and I'll tell you what I wish for. I always wish for more kindness and patience in the world. What, you expected me to say something like I wish I had a gold-plated camera case? Well, I wish for that too, okay? Aw, oh, you're cute. I really like shock. I mean, we have two smugs now, but I'm alright with it. I thought of something. What was it I thought of I had wished I had done? <laughs> there was something I thought of after I was done recording. This happens every time I do a house. And I'm like, oh, you know what I should have done? And now I don't remember what it was. I think we will have to eventually change the exterior colors a little bit. Maybe go just more of a natural wood or something instead of the red. I think that'll work. Something close to like what Patty... Patty, oh my gosh, Paula has. like the style house. We just need to change that a bit. Maybe we'll do that now. Let's just do that now. We'll leave the interior alone. We'll do that. I want to go check out Harv's Island. I was just running around and catching bugs and digging up flowers and arranging things a little bit. So let's sell some stuff. Mm. <laughs> and as usual, I don't have my voice yet. <laughs> Okay, none of these are new that need to be turned in to blathers. I'm just selling my extra DIYs. I gave a whole bunch to my husband, and I don't remember now which ones I've given him, so I'm not going to give him any more <laughs> to avoid duplicates. Hey, we got some miles. Yeah, I was planning on just um, waiting until nighttime in game to record. And then realized we're just going to be a little bit busy this evening. And I really, I saw Jacques was home and I really wanted to see how his house was looking. But yeah, let's change the exterior. And I was afraid if I, you know, time traveled to this evening, Jacques might not be inside the house. I think it's looking okay. Yeah. Hello, Tom Nook. Uh, let's talk homes. Uh, residents. Still need to do Hamfrey. Maybe Drago's. I wish Drago were in his house right now so we could look at it. I wish I could think of what else it was I wanted to do with Jacques' house. Unless now I'm confusing it with a vacation home. Oh, no, I'm thinking of a vacation home. I thought, I wondered if you could use, probably not, but the dusting technique, you know, how you can make things look like they have steam. I wondered if you could do that on the swimming pool and make it look like it had steam coming out of it like it were a hot tub. That's what I was thinking of. I got you, Jacques. Leave it to me. I love his coloring. That lime green with the navy blue. I like it. Can't believe I'm spending 9,000 bells just to do the uh, front door and roof. Okay. At least we can do that from here. That's nice.
But yeah, I think... Mm, oh. Right? Maybe we'll go with a different color exterior as well. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Or just a completely different exterior. That's... That's what Paula has. That's what Hornsby had, and I liked the way his house looked. I think that's what he had. Like an orange, although... Mm, this isn't Jacques' style. I think that's what Hornsby had, and it looked good. I do kind of like this style. Let's just go with some different colors here. Hmm. Might keep it black. Oh, Gwes, how's the green? No. The black brick trim could work with a different door and roof. It's not bad. I don't like the white trim on that. I didn't like the red with the flowers. Oh, I don't like that at all. Let's, uh... <laughs> we'll play around a bit. Try to get... No, 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 no. Yeah, let's, let's, let's just stick with... I like the black siding. Hmm. Now... Pink is an interesting choice. I kind of don't mind that. <laughs> I don't think we'd go with the pink door. I think that would be too much. I don't even mind that. I wish the... Actually, I, maybe we do like that. I wasn't sure about the design in the window, what color. It's hard to decide, guys. I'm, these are like the small little details that I get really hung up on. I kind of like that. I'm just not really feeling any of these wreaths. We might just, haha, <laughs> bunny day, keep a wreath off of it. I kind of like the skull a little bit, though. I don't know why. I was leaning that way last time as well. Oh, the horseshoe. That's kind of neat. Do we like it on that door? I feel like the door is fancy, so it doesn't really need anything. Let's just do this. I think I like that. I think I'll like it with the orange flowers in the area. Um, let's leave it as is. Thank you, Mr. Nook. All right, thank you. I will be sure to check it out tomorrow. I'm gonna go see if Humphrey is at home. Every time I run into his house, I wanna redo it. I just don't know how. I like, he's got that table, I forget what it's called, it's that heating kind of warming table in the middle. Oh yeah, he's either still asleep or not home. <laughs> Wonder what time he's going to wake up. Hmm... So yeah, this will look better. I like the red on that black, but just not with all of the orange flowers in the area. And so I don't want to uh, redo all the flowers. I wish Drago would run up and ask me to come to his house with him. <laughs> Let's go to Harv's Island, and then when we come back, we'll see if Humphrey is awake. I'm 
kind of ready for a couple of my villagers to move. <laughs> I like Robin and Wendy. I just kind of want to freshen up with some new villagers. So I wouldn't mind saying bye-bye to those two, for sure. I like Paula, but again, wouldn't mind a different Peppy. I think part of it's because I enjoy doing their houses. Probably should have run the, through the museum before going here because I am not going to remember what all we have in our museum. We need an app on our phone for that, like our other donations. Where you can see if you donated a bug or a fish. I need to know if I've donated artwork. There's not a category for that, I don't think. I do have an app. I just haven't sat and filled it all in with what I have and don't have. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. Oh, that'll be a good project for me. That's why I can't play tonight. The Warriors playoff game is tonight, and we're Warriors fans in this household. So, um... Yeah, but maybe while that's on, I'll just sit there with my app and my game in handheld mode and just update all my DIYs and stuff. This one, we... Ugh. I don't know if we have this one, because if the guy's arm is too tall or raised up too high in the back, it's fake. I gotta look it up, so sorry. We gotta open the interwebs here. Someday I'll actually bookmark this. Um, solemn painting. There we go. I like Polygon for their list. Put on my glasses. Solemn painting. Yeah, that's a fake. His arm is up too high. In the real one, it's just a little bit lower. And I have the piece that's right next to him there. Okay. So, nope, got it and don't want it. You okay, Scarlet? Okay, she's grooming. I thought she was coughing. Uh, no thanks, cousin. <laughs> Let's see if Kix has anything cute. He sometimes does. Whoa. Have I been. I'm just sorry. I just noticed my microphone <laughs> was in a weird position. It was like aimed below my chin. So let me move it back a little bit. Oh, guys, sorry. I hope this is okay. I think we're okay. Um, I think I have some of the kitty sneakers. I don't need cleats. Mm, I have some tote bags. It's kind of a cute backpack. I never wear them as I'm wearing a backpack. Oh, yeah, I gotta remember to give Dom... Oh, I'm scatterbrained. Dom his shirt. Remember we got him the little red tank top with barbells on it or dumbbells. Uh, ice cream shop wall. Oh, let's get the rice patty wall. I might have it. But still. Oh, it's another one of the uh, summoning circle floors. I forget what it's called. Oh, uh, I don't remember. Um, I don't need field flooring. Yeah, I need that because I gave, I was going to give one to my husband on his island and then ended up not wanting to part with my only one. Although I could have taken it back. I think he likes his camping room. I did though instead, so. <laughs> yeah, I think he likes his attic and his basement, which is what I kind of figured. I knew the other rooms would be like, girl, what did you do to my house? And that was the reaction. Hey, Sahara, thanks. We'll get the little round red rug as well. Might as well get this tropical one, too. It's kind of neat. I don't think I've noticed it in my designs. So, I'm sure, I don't know, maybe it does show up. Not sure how many of these round medium mats I have or in what colors, so it doesn't hurt to have more. Okay. Uh, we are content. Might as well get our fortune read while we're here. The last three times I've had her cleanse 
my spirit or whatever it is she does. She sent me the uh, gold turtle three times in a row. So hopefully if we have bad luck, she'll cleanse us and we'll get a little different gift. Although it is appropriate, we are turtle time. I guess I should get them out of storage and find places around the island to display them. Hmm. I could probably put one near the little froggy table. That area needs a little more, a little more stuff. Lee, I still need to change my passport picture. <laughs> Holding healthy turnips in hand and smiling brightly, they do this near a small village that one cannot even find on a map. Okay, our luck with money will improve. Oh, good thing. Oh, I dug up my money spot already. That's all right. I haven't hit rocks yet, or and I've only shook a tree or two. <laughs> okay. I want to go give Dom his gift. See if Hamphrey is awake. If Hamphrey's awake, maybe we will do his house. I don't know. Hello. We could just warm it up a bit. Or go with a whole new vibe for him and just give him a really neat, like, skyscraper apartment. <laughs> Thank you, fellas. I didn't get to play yesterday, so it's kind of nice getting getting back into it this morning. Um, let's put this stuff away. I, I really love having um, the storage cabinet with me at all times. Especially now when you never know if you just run into your house for a minute if uh, you're going to be invaded by a villager. I like their visits. It's not when I'm right in the middle of stuff. Okay, let's see. I can find it quickly here. I haven't even seen Dom, so hopefully he's at home. Okay, where did I miss it? Watch me have bought it and then accidentally sold it would be something I would do. I don't remember what it was called. Ah, here it is. Muscle tank. I think this will look cute on Dom, so let's wrap it and give it to him. I've got a lot of fossils in my inventory. at home. I still like his house. I'm so glad we put a pool in it. <laughs> that way he still has his workout space and his yard and we got him a different barbecue. I just like that he lives in a little backyard. There you are, Moxie. Okay, commence Dom's special training. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Indeed-a-roo. I'll train in the pool. You look totally ripped in your striped shirt. But if you want to look both ripped and shredded at the same time, take a catcher's mask. The color is really going to complement your physique, Indeedaroo. Oh, wow, thanks, Dom. Anyway, hope you enjoy. Oh, no. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's really me, Dom. Thanks. <laughs> I should just only ever wear what they give me. That would be hilarious. Here, this is for you. I think you're gonna look adorable. Whoa, this looks like a muscle tank. Awesome, this should really help me highlight my delts. Oh, it does, you're adorable, bud. You kind of stretch out the image there, though. Thank you, this is definitely my style in Dideru. He's so cute, I love our little Dom. Oh yeah, I forgot we did this really fun wall. I like it. 
Ah, you must be admiring my barbecue. Perfect, right? I feel like I'm roughing it, even when I'm all snug in my house. Alright, bud, we'll see you later. Let's go see if Humphrey is awake. Drago's is the one house I might not do anything to. It's just such a cool house. If there were like an imperial sofa or something, or, I'm not going to put a bed in there, so that's a big bed, the imperial bed. Hey, he's awake. I just, I need to warm it up a bit for him. I'm just, I'm not sure how or what I want to do. Maybe we'll just, I'll, I'll think about it overnight and do it later in the week, I think. I want to chat. You can't beat the simple, clean look of a striped shirt. Are you going to give me a lovely gift, too? It's just plain profession to see clothes that don't make my eyes tired to look at. Snort. Oh, I love the little grumpy guys. Or our crankies. I want the DIY for this. Well, what do you think of my place? It may not be much, but everything in here is something I love. I, I've got to really kind of figure out and think on what I want to do for his house. Are we able to use the design app here on our island? I haven't done the room sketch. I'm going to play with this tonight, too, maybe, in, while in handheld mode. Okay, we're not going to do it right now. But while I'm watching the game, I don't want to save it. I just want to quit. Okay. Anyway, I might do that. We got to figure out Hamfrey's house. It'll be cute, or maybe not cute. But I want to. I just he needs a better a better interior. I want to keep the bonsai bench and. This little raccoon or whatever you call it statue that I don't have yet. I've yet to have it on either of my islands. He likes warmth because that table keeps you warm. And then he's got a space heater as well. Um, let's move ahead to tonight. We'll go to like 9 p.m. I guess maybe. Hopefully Celeste will be here. I think she is when there's... Shooting stars. Well, should I go a little bit earlier in the evening and see if she's at the roost? I've heard sometimes she's at the roost, like a, in the hour or so before. Nah. <clears throat> Let's just get right to it. And yeah, 8. We'll do 9 p.m. Oh, I have a little sip of tea. Mm-hmm. Oh, I hope the warriors play well tonight. If not, it's going to be very loud in my household. Are you any of you uh, roommates, spouses, or just very close friends with anyone who's big into sports who has to comment and cuss <laughs> and yell throughout an entire game? <laughs> or am I just a special kind of lucky? <laughs> it's really bad during football season when his team's playing, but I find basketball is almost worse to watch <laughs> because he has more opportunities to yell at the TV because the action just doesn't stop. It's just constant. Whereas baseball, you've got a long, a lot of waiting time in between pitches and stuff. Football, you got all the time it takes for them to get set on the field before the snap and all that. But basketball, it's just nonstop. <laughs> I saw a meme that said you should never marry someone until you've watched a sporting event with them. Kind of right. I still would have married him though. Oh, I gotta turn up my sound. I don't miss any. Well, it's okay if I miss some. Hi, Wendy. You wanna move? What a super evening, lambkins. 
My sked for tonight is packed. There's a monster movie on TV, video games to play, music to blast. It might just be an all-nighter. That sounds like most of my nights. So let's see if we can find Celeste around here. Plus, I never really get to see my, my uh, island at night. I'm always playing in the early morning hours. I like the more chill music. Maybe we can find a scorpion or find Wisp hanging out. Usually when she's here, she's up on one of my higher levels. But we'll check the beaches first. Oh. Well, I guess I better help this guy out, too. I, last, last time he was here, I forgot about him, so I better do it. We'll do this while we're looking for Celeste. Okay, Gulliver, come on. Snap out of it, bud. I wish we could just use our watering can on him to get him up right away. Who's at the helm? Just give me five more minutes. No more minutes. <laughs> up. <laughs> oh, I still want to do a vacation home for him, too. I kind of want to do, like I was just saying for Hamfrey, I want to do... Like a high-rise apartment. I kind of want to do the same for Gulliver. I feel like he's had enough of being passed out on beaches. And he needs like a city dwelling. I know, I'm sure your crew is really worried sick. Never feel fear will be reunited in a jiffy. Yeah, well, your phone is broken and that's not handy or dandy. Our, oh, sardines. Come on. <laughs> let's Let's just get it. Come on. I know. Come on. Of course. Oh. It would be rude to say no. It'd be kind of funny, though, if you said no and he was just stuck on your island. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Gulliver. Excuse me, please. Excuse me, please. Oh, just dig the... Just, there you go. Fill it in. time he was here I did this I got all kinds of uh um vanilla <laughs> vanilla manila clams it was crazy uh, it doesn't hurt to have bait though let's do a little look for Celeste I didn't look behind the walls I always forget to look behind these walls I still kind of want to get rid of them for this reason She's not up here. I like how this looks at night. This is pretty cool too. It lights up when you click on it. Down to the beach for more digging. Oh, there's Dom. He's back in his one of his. I love his tie dyed shirt though, so I, I like seeing him in that. Yo, Dom. Hey, I know it's out of the blue. <laughs> no, bud. I'm busy. I'm, sh I'm, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I hate saying no to them. But I've got a couple things going on right now. Now, where did that spitty spot go? <laughs> spitty spot. <laughs> I think that's three. I do want to say hi to... P oh, I talked to Pietro earlier, but we can say hi again. Ooh. Yeah, I gotta remember the shooting stars, too. Bonjour. Let's talk. You know you can always come talk to me about anything, right? Like if you don't know what kind of socks to wear with faux alligator boots. The answer is no socks. Oh, but seriously, we can talk about anything. It doesn't have to be sock-related. I'm gonna let that balloon go. Unless I get to it. I don't know. I'm more interested in parts. Oh, well, hell, it's right there. Ooh, I said hell. Excuse me. 
<laughs> and I'm totally ignoring the shooting stars. I'm like, oh, I need to get to work. <laughs> I don't. I haven't had a lot of um, uh, shooting star nights, but like I said, I also don't play a lot at night. Love when it's a meteor shower, though. Get a whole bunch of them. Come on. Oh, there we go. Of course. I dug right next to it. Is that four? Yes. Just one more. We'll return these, and then we will go see if Celeste is here. We can always double check if she's even on our island by uh, working out in the plaza. But I, <laughs> I do want to finish with Gulliver before I find her, because I will forget. I have that knack. Yep, got him right here. <laughs> But I want to wish on stars. Okay, you got him. Great. Spin, dance, flourish. Tell, let, let's cram him in there and send a message. <laughs> it's your brother from another rudder. Listen, it happened again. Can you swing by to pick me up? Thank you. Yep. Good, good, good. Sorry you had to sleep there all day. I honestly didn't see him there when I was running around this morning, but I guess I didn't poke down on the beach. Okay, good good luck, bud. Hope they're they come to you soon. Okay, so let's find out if she's here. I'm pretty sure she shows up when you have a meteor shower. But now we'll know for sure. I think. Hmm. Yes, there she is. Now we're gonna make Gulliver work out too. He needs the exercise after leaping it off on our beach all day long. I should get up and do this with the uh, toy con. <laughs> Not just sit here on my butt. <laughs> it would feel good. I do need to stretch and stuff more like that. Faces are just so cute. <laughs> Wendy. <laughs> Oops. I'm off. <laughs> They're cute. I'm not sure. I think I've gotten all of the rewards from doing this, but maybe not. I'll have to look that up. is cute. You know why I'm off a little bit? I still have a little bit of lag with my sound when I'm I'm um, just listening to it on the uh, computer instead of on the TV. I thought I fixed my little sound lag issue this weekend. I guess I did not. Alright, let's trek down Celeste. <laughs> little happy faces. Well, that worked out. Too bad I don't have any friends I could invite over <laughs> right now to do it, but they're all at work. 
We're doing other stuff, I'm sure. <laughs> Be funny if we had Wisp here, too. Here she is. She loves this spot. I usually find her here. Good evening, Moxie. Have you been admiring the sky? So many shooting stars tonight. Would you care to watch nature's most beautiful performance with me? I would. Oh, I gotta show you guys something I just learned, too, from a Mayor um, Mori video. I watch his YouTube videos. I really, they're very helpful. Let's see what recipe we get. I recall, if you show her a star fragment or something, I believe she tells you about it. Look at the tourist bathtub. Neat. I think that's what he said in his video. It's been a few days since I watched it. <laughs> and we all know my memory isn't the greatest. Let me grab something out. I know I have some. Might I help you with something? Yeah, take a look at this. So thank you, Mayor Mori, for this tip. Of course, what you have there is an Aries fragment. There are many tales and stories about Aries. This is my favorite. Long ago and far away, there was a pair of royal twins named Rixus and Hel, Hel whose stepmother, the queen, hated them. When one of the queen's schemes put the twins' lives in peril, their mother prayed to Zeus for help. A flying sheep with golden fleece descended from the heavens and rescued the twins. Zeus commemorated the event by hanging the image of the sheep in the stars as the constellation Aries. Did you notice how Zeus celebrates things Zeus did for Zeus's followers by hanging things in Zeus's sky? Oh, that was a mouthful. Oh, please, pardon me. I didn't mean to talk so long. You must have other places to be. Let's have her look at the other one. I, I have more. I don't want to do all of them. But isn't that neat? So it's just like her brother Bladders. If you give her a star fragment, she'll tell you the, the info about it. The lore. What you have there is some Capricorn fragments. There are many tales and stories about Capricorn. This is my favorite. Long ago and far away. The gods were enjoying a fantastical banquet by a river when the terrible monster Typh Typhon appeared. Unprepared as they were for a fight, the gods assumed various animal shapes and fled with all speed. But Pan, the goatish god of shepherds, jumped into the river, transforming as he did so. Perhaps because he was so shocked, he did not finish changing himself into a fish and only changed his tail. The chief god Zeus was highly amused at the sight of a goatfish and hung the image in the stars. I feel sort of bad for Pan in that story having a constellation based on this embarrassing incident. It would be a bit like someone making a billboard of you while you were changing your clothes. Oh, please pardon me. She is adorable. I love this. But let me return this before you go. Thank you, Celeste. really find that interesting. So you can learn some fun stuff by showing her your star fragments. We'll put them away. I want to get a cute thumbnail with her, but she's not in the best spot. Well, that's not too bad. Look for some stars. Oh, she's wishing on them, but I don't see any. That's cute. I wonder if she'll pose for our phone. Oh, she's in a really bad spot for it, though. Try and get her where we want her. No, I'm going to get stuck here. I know I'm missing stars, but I'll have lots of opportunity. Oh. Yeah, perfect. Turn off the lights. Why are you going behind the house? Les, come on now. Compose for a picture with me here under the lights.
want one more. Oh, she's so cute. I love her big bow. Well, she's not cooperating, is she? Okay, I can't think of anything else to do. I think we're gonna wrap this one up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's see if she'll... Oh, cute. Oh, no, come on, turn around and do it again. All right, I'll keep trying this. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Take care.